I wonder why she didn't just have kids with her husband. Maybe he literally like they, cannot get it up. He, there's ways to do it. Remember fucking um, Robert Baratheon's brother was struggling so hard with Marjorie, and she's like, do you want my brother to come in? Like, how are we going to make this work? But that's what I'm saying. Like, make it work. But it still wouldn't. Make it work. What's going on, guys? Welcome, welcome back to Dan Reacts. I'm Dan. This is my reaction channel. I am here with the one and only mother of dragons, Addie. How's it going? It's good. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. It's the next morning. We did a pretty, you know, crazy, a crazy styled binge yesterday, I should say. We typically, we were if we're place. watching a 10 episode series, we'll typically do five episodes in a day. Yesterday, for some reason, we were just getting so distracted. We were derailed that, for like, hours on end. We went until four o'clock in the morning doing what we were doing. We could not focus, you guys. Like we could not get it done. We could, but we at the same time we did like, get it done. Had to because I we had to see like what was gonna happen. And like truly, the the reason I went to bed was because I was like, if I don't. That's a problem. Like, it's not even that I'm tired in this moment. It's just that I know that it's 4 a.m. and that's way too late. We, we need to go to bed. We're, we need to go to bed. Yeah, exactly. The sun's going to come up. But the sun came up. It's the next day. And I'm very excited because we're here for episode six, which is the second half of this show. So I'm like, oh, what's going to be different? Is it going to be? I don't know. We're over the hump. But I mean, that last episode was crazy. It feels kind of like a fever dream because we watched it so like early in the morning. But it was like that wedding was insane. It was so suspenseful and intense. Yes. And like Kristen and the, all the drama I was like at the edge of my seat that I just like cannot wait to continue to see this unfold. But I'm also curious if like it's just going to jump. I feel like four it's, years. it keeps doing that. So I would expect that it will jump. Like we won't actually get to see the direct the aftermath direct. of the wedding ceremony because it was like, right. you know. I agree. I we'll think see. it's going to jump. Yeah. But I mean, cheers. I'm very excited for this. <sighs> Let's get right into it. Let's start our Sunday Strong. House of the Dragon, season one, episode six. <laughs> Okay. What are we doing? Is this Rhaenyra? Uh huh. So she's giving birth. She's having a baby. With who? Is it Lanos? And again. <laughs> Oh, the sound of the, like... <laughs> yeah. The queen has requested that the child be brought to her. What? Why? Why? Damn, not even giving her a second to rest. She still has to birth the placenta and stuff. <sighs> like, you're not even giving me one second of time with my baby? The afterbirth. The afterbirth. Oh God. Oh boy. Lenor. Let me take it. I'm not sure get any such satisfaction from you. Yeah, just take my arm. The least. Was it terribly painful? Yeah, it was birth, dude. What mm -hmm. kind of question? I can't, I'm surprised she's even fucking walking. And also, like, great. Now there's like a whole crowd of people right here. Like, couldn't you have cleared out the hall? I just gave birth. Walk. Walk. This is an incredible shot. It's like all just one. Oh. Princess. Oh, that's her guard now. You should be resting after your labors. Chris. It's so kind of cool to see two new actresses doing this. Like, it makes it fresh. Oh, he's still alive! Kicking still strong. Kicking. Oh, look at his hair, though. Woof! His arm is gone. Is it? I didn't mm. even notice. It is. It's the babe of a name yet. We haven't still free. What? <clears throat> If you don't mind, Your Grace, your daughter has exerted herself heroically and should rest. 
Can I have the baby back, you fucks? I do hope the labor was easy. Oh, well, at least they've been they've able made to up. make some amends. I mean, it's been a long time, clearly. Sooner or later, you pick it when it looks like you. What? Why is she, like, being a bitch? Mother. Look. Oh, this is her third. Those are not his babies. That's why she said maybe you'll get one that looks like you. They're not his. My time. So Harwin wishes to be introduced to Joffrey. Joffrey, is it? We, we like, literally just could not escape that name. Like, why has it got to be Joffrey? Who is that? Why don't I know who that is? None of them have, like, blonde hair or anything either. Dragon! Oh wow, these are the dragon pits before they were ruins. Mm -hmm. Oh, I would love to have a dragon. Dracaris Vermax! Yeah, Lame that goat! That goat died quick, at least. You were the only one of us without a dragon. Indeed. And we felt badly about it. Oh, oh that's fucked up. Behold, the, the pink, pink dragon! <laughs> <laughs> What jerks? Why does Amon's not have a dragon? Well, he's gonna. He's I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Whatever you're about to do. I feel like going down there is a bad move. I know they're used to it, but I just feel like I would be terrified. Well, you still should be terrified. I mean, like, they're dragons, and none of them are yours, so I wouldn't go down there. Like, get out of there. I don't know what you expected. I know. Like, what were you looking for, kiddo? <laughs> two pairs of legs on each. That's 240. Her daughter, like, almost looks exactly like Rhaenyra. Exactly like Rhaenyra. Okay, first of all, who the fuck just plays with the Millipedes? Like, creepy, get that creepy, shit creepy. out of your hand. They said they found a dragon for me. The last ring has no legs at all. But it was a pig. Okay, she's fucking... Sis, put it down. You'll have to close an eye. I know it. He won't laugh. Is it just because his, like, egg hasn't hatched or something? Viserys. <gasps> We shall continue this afternoon, Eddard. Eddard. That was Ned's name. Eddard. I have raised this matter before, and you forbade me to speak of it, so I held my tongue. To have one child like that is a mistake. To have three is an insult. The consequences of an allegation like the one you planned. Like, why do you even care so much? She cares so much about what Rainier does. Just leave it alone. Have I lost my sanity, Sir Kristen? Do my senses lead me astray, or is everyone else asleep, dreaming the same woolly dream? I do think you have lost your senses. I think you need a hobby. I think you need to... You need to get a fucking life. Get a sport. I have to believe that in the end, honour and decency will prevail. Mm. Honour and decency? When has that ever prevailed? Oh, what are we doing? Oh my god, is that the same tower that Joffrey jumps out of? We must defend our own. Your very life could be forfeit. You are the challenge! You are the challenge, Egon! Simply by living and breathing! She has lost it. You are the king's firstborn son. One day you will be our king. That sounds like a horrible idea. He was just jacking yeah, off in a fucking windowsill. Is 
Damn. She really, uh... She gave it to him. She's a little paranoid. Oh, that's a very cool looking dragon. I like that tail. And like it's the like a legs. Snake tongue. And like, wow. Oh, that's Damon's. There he is. We just only saw it really like in the night or like, this is the first real like daylight shot we've gotten. Oh, and Lena. That was cool. Okay. They have a fun little arrangement. Lamb hearts are excellent. We are fortunate in our cook, Your Excellence. They're going to conquer. Two egg on the Two egg on. Your family has dragons. Three now, perhaps four. Your Excellence, we are travelers. We've already extended our visit here. Mommy will certainly entertain. I love how, like, back in that day, like, her simply entering the room was a signal that you need to leave. <laughs> like, whatever you're doing, it's over. We are not minstrels or mummers who play at the pleasure of an alien prince. We are the blood of old Valeria. And at my end, I want to die a dragon rider's death. Not that of some fat country lord. Damn, she was riding pregnant. Bad. Just realized that. Bad bitch. Bad bitch, okay. He's just, like, not acknowledging her. Great. We love to see that. He's like, did you say something? Sorry? Anyways, I'm reading. That kid just looks exhausted all the time. He does look, like, tired. Oh, my God. His skin is so bad. Yeah, he looks, like, dead. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> It's like so not even an effort for Kristen. It's like one handed. Trisharis. You spar with that gun. Kristen seems a little more. Uh, He's like really pissed. Angry too, yeah. Yeah! Jesus. Stay on the attack! Jesus. Oh my god, Ivan is unhinged. Most men would only have that kind of devotion toward a cousin or a son. Damn. Oh, this is. Tensions are high this in this is castle. Parallel. Oh, wow. He beat up someone for talking too much about his business. Same thing just happened to him. Princess, there's been an incident in the yard. Your two men that you have fucked are fighting. Your baby daddy's gonna be in big trouble, I think. He is a knight of the king's guard, sailed like a of future heads of the king's guard. Your intimacy with the princess Rivia. Really is an offense to between exile and death. She's basically Cersei because her children are I was, was going to say that earlier. Like, Cersei did this shit and nobody did anything. But she doesn't have Tywin as a father. She's oh. got Viserys. Who is damn near death. <laughs> What are we doing? This is a bachelor party? My dear wife. Oh, he's been having a good day today. Would you mind, Sir Carlo? I would like to speak with my husband. Of course, princess. He's a little bit of a train wreck. I mean... He's gonna get drunk and spill the beans. Being in a marriage that you're not in is a train wreck. But, like, you agreed to it? Do you know what's happened? 
and you've been guzzling all the ale in flea bottom and got to know what besides. For ten years, you have indulged yourself at court. You do not desert your post when the storm lashes. That's fair. True. You are commanded to remain in King's Landing and at my side. Well. So there you have it. You're not leaving. You are commanded. Not that I want to command people, but... Sometimes you gotta pull rank. That would be kind of nice. Half of them never do, you know. Hatch. There is more than one way to bind yourself to a dragon. But if you wish to be a rider, you must claim that right. Aww. She's beautiful. Yeah. She was so beautiful, it like made you sigh. You're like, yeah. Yeah, she is beautiful. Leonor has written. Rhaenyra has delivered another son. Also bears a marked but entirely coincidental resemblance to the commander of the city of <laughs> <laughs> I mean. Uh, yeah, it does. It does. Yeah, he looks the exact same. Except uh, he's got his. His nose. Apparently. Do you never long for home? No. You do not sleep! Well, how can I with you haunting my every move? Oh shit. That was rude. Haunting my every move. The man I married is more than this. I mean, she's a supportive wife. I was gonna say, her and Allison really are doing their duties. Well, Allison's, I don't know. She is loyal to him. She's gotten much more self-serving. I agree. The Brackens and the Blackwoods will use any excuse to spill each other's blood. This dispute bears looking into. Jeez. Drama! Yeah, it's like so outward now. Like, before their tension was much more like subtle. Under the surface. Now it's like, no, I'm gonna start under my breath saying shit about you. Watchtowers, a fleet of ships, a garrison of soldiers sent to hold our ground. We cannot afford it. We must consider the cost to our subjects. I must the cost of war is greater. Oh, ladies. She's going for it. Let's be finished. I wish to speak. Be seated. He's holding on to life. Oh! Be seated, bitch. We are one house. And long before that, we were friends. Aww. My son, Jocerys, will inherit the Iron Throne after me. I propose we betroth him to your daughter, Helena. King's like... <sighs> like, dead peace! Just, like, blissfully unaware of how fucked up everything's going on. Additionally... If Cyrax brings forth another clutch of eggs, your son, Aemond, will have his choice of them. That's a very nice offer. She's like, stop coming for me. Oh. Oh, Seven Hills. Um. The King and I thank you for your offer, and we will consider it duly. You must rest now, husband. Oh, she has got his claws in him so deep. And she is literally leaking Lactating. in the middle of her meeting. How degrading. The fact that Allison went, Rhaenyra, like, told her about it. Rhaenyra. There's a sliver of friendship still. Rhaenyra, your fly is down. Rhaenyra, you're a little wet. <laughs> you're a little leaky. We're a family. Let us put aside these childish quarrels. Joined hands will be stronger for it. But I am cold in my grave. Oh, jeez. Oh, she is so mad at what? She is like, it's like, is it jealousy? Like, what yeah, is it? Yeah, or like, I don't even know. She got married off to a gay man, and you're mad that they're not having sex. Like, it, get over it. <sighs> King is resting. I will see him. He's like, stop fucking controlling me. But like, look at it. <laughs> he does need the help. 
I'm being endlessly fussed over my now. It's a mother I could visit the privy alone. Oh. Your Grace, I feel. I have come to resign my position as hand of the king. Oh. oh no. Oh, this one arm. What is this shadow? You must have your reasoning in plain language. He's like, I'm not talking to you. I said no. If you insist, my king, I do. I would then ask leave to take my son from court and escort him back to the family seat at Harrenhal. Do it. She needs to chill. She really is so mad for no reason. You could help me. Oh. What is her damage? What is your damage? What's the beef? What broke? Like you'd rather have them all killed, really. Oh, this guy. Linus. King of Moodians, who my father. He attempted to resign his post. Do you expect the king to boom his dear daughter to exile, or even... Tell you not now. Tell you, get out. Get the fuck out, we're discussing very secretive shit right now, like... Gossiping. Fucking treason and betrayal and plotting. He wouldn't hesitate to speak the truth to the king if Otto Hightower was still at hand. You can't say, my queen. If Otto Hightower was still at hand, many other stupid decisions would have been made. Right. You would need to let go of this. Well, it's like, it's clear she wants the, th the throne for her sons. Yeah, she doesn't actually care that they're not her kids. She just wants something to take them down. Mm -hmm. What a collection of heroes I have before me. I am prepared to offer you mercy. What are we doing? What? Sorry, what? No, 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 no. No, what are we pulling teeth? Are we pulling teeth? Tongues? No! He's cutting their tongues out and then letting them live. Oh God. Oh my god, is it not working? God, childbirth is nasty in this show. Child will not come. Do not! Where the fuck did she go? Oh, she's running her ass away. She's like, you're not cutting me open. Uh, I've seen this movie. I know how this story ends. Oh, she's literally gonna run away? Bleeding out? With a baby that won't come out? Dracarys! Oh, she's committing suicide? Dracarys! Sick looking dragon. Oh, he won't do it. Dracarys! It's like a dinosaur dragon. T-Rex dragon. Baby, just keep pushing. Oh my god. That's some gnarly shit. Imagine walking out on the beach and you just see your wife burn herself alive. You're like, damn, it's that deep? I wasn't even, I wasn't really even considering Lena. I just was kind of But she dies either way. No, yeah, maybe. but it's just like, oh shit, you didn't need to do that. You need to, we could have had a conversation about this. We could have at about least this. had a drink. Jeez. I will return. Probably not. I promise. 
Have fun at Heron Hall. I wonder why she didn't just have kids with her husband. Maybe he literally like they, cannot get it up. He, there's ways to do it. Remember fucking um, Robert Baratheon's brother was struggling so hard with Marjorie, and she's like, do you want my brother to come in? Like, how are we going to make this work? But that's Maybe what I'm saying. Like, make it work. But it still wouldn't. Make it work. Like, have him fuck a guy until he's right there, and then... Just catch the... Just catch and then the, hop on top. Yeah. How unstrong my father. You are a Targaryen. As well that is. Okay. I feel like you should have said, no, he's not your father. Because kids have big mouths. Right. And you also kind of just directly answered him. That's all that matters. No, it's not. I'd be like, no, mom, what? Tell me the fucking truth. Mom, Did you adopt me or not? Am I going to die? Adopt me? <laughs> like, you know, like in real life where it's like, tell me if I'm adopted. Am I adopted? What? Excuse me, boyfriends. Do you Can mind uh, pausing this whatever? This whatever you're doing? I made a spectacle. They whisper about me in the corridors, but I leave them to it. Bring him. Lead every sword we can see. That's sweet of her. I know. She's just... She's a good person. Why is everybody fucking after her? That's, this is that's an impossible you go situation. You go after the good people. I guess so, but damn. In the midst of all this, she's letting him keep his boyfriend? Like, that's so nice. So thoughtful. I'm sure he would have found another, but, like, so nice. My lover, or whatever he called him, just got shipped away to Heron Hall. You can bring yours. My life's going down the fucking tubes. People are trying to kill me, but, like, don't let me stop you. Heron Hall. <gasps> Wait. Oh, were they sent to, like, kill them? Those are the prisoners. Oh boy. Gas. Poisonous gas. Fire? Yes. Oh, that makes more sense. Oh, Arwen! Jesus Christ! Well... You got yourself into a sticky situation. You are children. But a weakness. You persist forever. Oh my god. Love stays the hand. Poor Lena. Oh god. She was going to die anyways. She just chose how she did it. I know, but it's sad because we like met her so young. I know. Dad. You've heard the stories of Aaron Holy Grace. Paris. I did not wish for this. He is a creepy fuck. Wow, okay, well, we are very moved on in this show and in the plot, and it's feeling very, like, season one Game of Thrones vibes, like, questioning Cersei's, you know, sons. It's, like, very, like, oh, we've almost kind of seen this story before. I wonder if it's going to play out exactly that way. But, man, I really enjoyed those two actresses a lot. Like, yeah, cheers to them. They did I, a great job. Yeah, I almost... it. I've bought into it enough that I'm, like, I'm having to, like, imagine, like, what the other actresses, Actually, like, looked like. Because I'm like, wait, no. Like, it's it translates they well. They did a great job with the casting. Yes. There were some scenes where Allison was, like, sitting at the table, and I was like, no, it's crazy how she actually looks like that girl. Yeah. Like, they look the so same. much. And same with, like, the casting of Lena and Lenor. Like, mm -hmm. they started out as children to teens, and then we just saw them as adults. It's like, wow, they... The casting was good. The casting good. is really, really good for the show. Yeah. And not all characters age. Like, Damon has been the same age the whole show. You know, Kristen, same character the whole show. So it's, like, interesting to see 
the ones that are aging as the actors and then the ones that have like literally just stayed who they are the entire time. Yeah. Very good episode. Very good. Very good. That was a lot of babies birth giving. It was a this birth whole giving show has episode. Been a lot of birthing and babies. A lot of birthing. And... Um that was I feel like we're starting a whole new show. Like it the storyline like is completely something new now mm-hmm. with the whole lineage and um it kind of makes those first five episodes really feel like a prequel. It was a setup. Right. Yeah, it, it was, was like establishing such a setup. the history, but it's like none of what they were focusing on in the first five episodes is even really Matters relevant yeah. Yeah, at all. Besides like kind of it. the Kristen Cole sleeping situation. Kind of, but I feel like nobody's even asking about Kristen at all. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It's like they're more concerned he's serving about the, the queen guy. now. What's but his name? Um, Harwin. Harwin. They were more concerned with him and like mm-hmm. that whole scandal. Which yeah, she the whole, clearly the whole did not Kristen learn her lesson. And like Damon like, thing is like not wasn't even brought up. Mm-hmm. I do have a lot of curiosity about what's going on with Damon and like because he's not just gonna lay dormant. Mm-hmm. So I am very interested to see like now he doesn't have Lena. It's him and these two girls, and it's like, what are we? doing from here right. you're obviously not gonna just chill in pentos mm-hmm. like he's just resting i feel mm-hmm. he's charging and i wonder what they're gonna do with her dragon i mean what happens there maybe her daughter that would be cute uh-huh. that would be cute it was really sad when he wouldn't burn her mm-hmm. he didn't want to he until like at her like until damon came out and yelled for her and then it was like Oh, okay. I get what's I'll, going on. I'll do monster. it. Yeah. But I felt so bad for the dragon. There's that's two his different mama. themes too of like children not able to get dragons. You saw yeah. that the Allison's son clearly has hatched. A- his egg his hasn't name? hatched. A- A- Amon. Amon. His egg hasn't hatched. Yeah. And then we know that her egg hasn't hatched. I don't remember her name, but yeah, either. hers hasn't hatched. So yeah. it's like. It's an interesting little parallel little parallels. theme. And then the parallel of Kristen Cole getting beat up for saying too much to somebody. Yeah, that really like struck you. Like 10 years ago, someone came up and said something to you. It and was you the wrong the info. You beat the fuck out of him. And honestly, you're lucky he didn't kill you because he almost did. Like, mm-hmm. if somebody didn't pull him off of Kristen, he was about to beat the pulp out of him. Because well, you literally just said, you sound like a brother. Or no, it sounds like he's your brother or yeah. son. It's like, okay, yeah. you're doing threatening, doing the most, threatening like, fighting stop. words right now. Like, you are trying to... I mean, he, you have to know. Like, that is a very serious thing to say, even if it is obviously true. Mm-hmm. Like, that's still... They've said, like, death to all of them, right. including the children. Kristen, like, why did you beat him up? Because you, you knew you could you die You basically that. threatened to kill not only me and Rhaenyra, but my sons. Mm-hmm. Like... Not just going to take that on the chin. Right. He feels much more like, I don't know, he's angrier. He's gotten more submissive. Kristen? To like, Allison. Well, I mean, again, she I think found he, him. He like admitted this thing. Couldn't handle the guilt or whatever. Which, by the way, just everybody needs to just take Stop a Stop confessing breath. on themselves. Like, you the hand. had sex with one person one time. Yeah. It's fine. The like, hand being he's like, like, I, I broke to... an oath. Like, yeah. I can't serve anymore. Like, just chill. I think that there are definitely members of the King's Guard that are having sex. Mm-hmm. And, like, yeah, it's part of your oath. But, like, it's not that serious. Right. And now you, it's like he's, like, confess that to the queen. She spared him death. And now he's, like, oh, mm-hmm. like, her servant. And Laris is her, like right hand but also kind of seemed like he's manipulating her well yeah and like, he's acting on his own whim like yeah. she specifically was like i did not ask we you to met do him that. as like this sweet little like oh he's like the Comforting off child her that's a little, got like a gimpy yeah. leg and like you know he's giving very like little finger but not as charming not as charming and a little bit more direct about like oh like, he's just doing the way that the queen was like horrified Wait, at what he did kill them. and he's like I think you'll thank me. It's like, no, she's mad. Like, right. she did Which, not like, want to do Which, like, low-key, Allison, you kind of alluded that you didn't want them in the picture anymore. So, like... <laughs> you, you just can't handle the consequences. But also... She's a very big, can't handle the to consequences. To not get, to like, actions. a direct, I want you to kill these people, and then to have gone and done that was 
a big leap. He's got a little psychosis issues in there, like, mm -hmm. like a little scared about that character. And his yeah. and he basically just killed his brother. Like you didn't just go kill random people. And he's like happy about you it. You set your brother to a and flame. you on like your dad. Like, Did his dad die too? Well, I don't know if he died, but he definitely could have. He yeah. was in the burning building. Wait, to be D. They didn't say whether he died or not. If but he, he couldn't dies, get the door that'll open. That'll be sad because the king literally just refused his. Like, That's why he said, I assume you'll call your father because I think he's like, Allison, oh, bring no. your father back to be the hand. We don't need him. I no, think no, no, that no, no, he no. did die. I think he died. We don't need him. We do not need him. No, we don't picture. need Otto back. I really loved that one shot they gave us in the very beginning, the, like immediately after Rainier gave birth. You watched her walk from like the bottom of the stairs yeah. all the way up the stairs into, and it was like rehearsed mm -hmm. dialogue. You know how we feel about those like timed Such rehearsed Such nice choreography. Scenes. It's like so great to see, and it's like, it makes it feel more like you're watching a documentary. Like something that's really happening. Right, like you're just a fly on the wall to this, as opposed to like an edited cut And it was version. such a good way to immediately establish, like, there is major beef here. Like, mm -hmm. the fact that she was like, the queen wishes to see the sun. Like, he came out of me 20 seconds ago. Mm -hmm. Not and even. And needed to be like, I'll take him. And she's like, no. She's like, you I'll cannot. I'll carry him. I'll, I'll bleed all over the ground. Literally, I'm gonna carry this him. is my newborn son mm -hmm. that just came out of me. Mm -hmm. I'm not handing him to you to take to the queen who hates me and my sons. Yeah. Like, why? So she could smother so him? So she could throw no. out the window? Right. Like, no, the, I'll go with the baby. Oh, here. and then fucking Aegon jerking off outside the window that I'm... I'm not even like... Let, me, let us know if you're somebody that's super window? good. Is that the window that Tommen jumps out of? Because that is it looks like so it. funny if it is. <laughs> like, it's just an iconic window. Iconic window. Iconic window. Lots of stuff going on in that window. I really um, loved it. The only other thing... What was I about to say? Uh, oh, I was going to say, and then you have Viserys, who's just, like, still, like, ah, 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 da -da 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 -da. like, no problems in the world. I mean, his health is going to shit, obviously. But he's, like, yeah, the baby's sleep. born, and he's, like, oh, amazing, you're going to be an amazing night. And, like, Allison is standing there, like, are you fucking joking? Like, he just will not be negative about anything he's just like it's or realistic fine. about what's it's actually all going fine. on yeah. it's, everything that's happening is good and i feel like before in the earlier episodes like it was very clear he's dying but i wasn't like it didn't necessarily it was like oh poor guy's dying but it wasn't like bothering me this episode made me feel so uneasy about his death because now i'm like no when he dies it's a very precarious shit's situation going to hit the fan yeah when he he's the only one they said he's the only one standing in between these allegations mm -hmm. being you know launched at rhaenyra if he dies the queen's gonna immediately be like those all are not your is, sons yeah. death to all of you mm -hmm. goodbye oh my god that would be such a leap like i know you're mad but like her and Rhaenyra have always come sort of back well, to peace. And her saying to her in the small friends. council, like, we used to be friends. I felt like that was a very big moment like for Rhaenyra. Branch. All, like, obviously, it's been 10 years, but the Rhaenyra we knew in the first five was the one that was mad. Yeah. Whereas Allison was, like, desperately trying to get to her to forgive her. her. Friend, yeah. So to see it, like, completely Flipped. flipped, yeah. it's like, oh, when did but you like, become the victim? But that's what I'm saying. Like, you obviously had a good friendship and you in previous episodes for years and years and years, wanted to repair the friendship, like, wanted to be friends. You're going to go from that to killing her and her sons? Like, that just seems like such a jump. It does. So, what an episode. What an episode. I'm very excited to see. I kind of am starting to get the Allison hate. I mean... I'm sorry. I to love see. that we're like referencing the Allison hate, even though we have not been online. I haven't actually read it, but I don't like, actually know. I know that it exists, and I'm no, kind definitely. of like, okay, I'm she's, starting to see why people are like, Cersei. fuck this bitch. Like, yeah. yeah, she's being an idiot. Like, she, well, she's, it's not, she's even, so emotional. It's not that she's being an idiot, it's that she's being like vindictive. Mm -hmm. It's like, you don't need to be mad about this. It doesn't concern you. Right. The only way that it concerns you is that they're in front of your sons for the throne. Mm -hmm. And, like, why do you care? Why do you care? You're the queen. Mm -hmm. Like, if Rainier is your best friend and she ascends the throne, still a good situation for you. Like, like I don't understand 
the I mean, that's Game of Thrones. Well, and that's the thing is she was trying to tell her son, like, you don't understand. Your life is at stake. Rhaenyra would never Rhaenyra's kill your children. Rhaenyra's not going to kill you However, your children. However, you're going to try you're and kill hers. You're trying to. Yeah. yeah. So it's like, stop feeding your son false narratives. You've already taken the first <laughs> step. The father of the children is dead. I mean, like, chipping away at the block. Well, and the son being like, is that my dad? It's like... Yeah. And then to see that is. he dies, like, oh, that's... You'll never have a relationship with your father. Sorry. N- never. Well, now you're you're going to have to just accept your father is not Am your I father. a bastard? Mm-hmm. You, you can either say yes, or you can go hang out with your gay dad. <laughs> I mean, to me, life, like, your in. life is better if you just don't acknowledge that. Yeah, you just don't say it out loud. Yeah. Like Cersei. No, that black man is your father. How did you come out looking like that? It's not my business. It's not your business. I don't know. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't make the rules. So, I'm very excited to keep going. Yes. I mean, we only have one more episode until the currently, live episode. but then we'll get like a live one in a couple hours so that'll be really nice to get i'm gonna do final cheers i think you're all out but that was just really incredible sh- it's bad luck really that incredible. Was incredible really loved it good job and also like i mean it's sad that she died but I, like i had to get props to her she was flying on that dragon pregnant like that the is insane. pregnant women in this show are the backbone of this country i mean it's this show truly makes pregnancy looks like the worst it looks like war. And world. honestly, as it should, because I'm sick of seeing pregnancy depicted as like, oh my God, she's so cute and pregnant, and whatever. That shit is gruesome. Mm-hmm. Like these births, no medicine, just raw dog in it. Blood like Blood trailing her your for miles. body literally splitting in half. Like mm-hmm. it's not like a beautiful, cool thing. I mean, the it dad's is beautiful, like, I trust but it's it so okay. it's like... brutal. Like when he's like, was it very painful? Bro, like, I, you've probably taken a poop that's ripped your butthole and been like, oh my god, my life is over. Like, I just pushed a baby out of me. Yeah. It was painful. I trust her with, well, like, well, I'm alive, so We're it's, both it's alive. better than I can say about my mom. Am <laughs> I, like, happy to be walking around right now? No. But here we the are. wants to see my son, so here we are. And then <laughs> as soon as she gets up there, you should be resting, like... No. You bitch. No. Shut up. I'm not leaving my son with you alone. Oh, I should be resting. Why'd you call me up here then? Yeah. Like, ew, stop. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, hit a like and subscribe button so you can stay up to date. We got seven, eight, nine, four more episodes to go. And mm-hmm. then we're going to be done. But we only have two more today, so we do still have, like, some time to milk this journey because we won't be yes. doing nine and ten. Just but I'm also, them. like, I feel like that's going to be... Because before, we hadn't even seen it. So it was like, oh, who cares that we're waiting? We don't know what we're getting into. Now I'm like, now I gotta like, know. Okay, well, what the fuck? Gotta know that's gonna, going on. And I guarantee you episode eight is going to end in like some And we're going to be like, what is going on? Yeah. It's okay. We'll get through it. We'll get through it. All right. Well, we hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And we'll see you in the next video.